Hello everyone and welcome back. <clears throat> Sorry about that. <clears throat> oh wow, some cheese in my throat. <laughs> so anyway, we are playing some more foundation and I just made a random world generation and kind of stuck with it. This is what we got. Okay, so literally... Okay, I claim that world land. I should have maybe checked over here. It seems like there's nothing really of interest except for over here, which then is pretty far away from everything. Ooh, this one also was pretty good. Oh, I should have maybe looked at it. Nah. Honestly, I'm more happy with this in a, a absolute island. I, ooh, oh my. This one we're going to have fun with. I honestly can't believe we have an island to work with. With fish. I'm, I'm, like, with fish. Like, I'm honestly surprised. Like, this is, ooh, they, we're gonna have fun with this. So, oh, where do I even want to put this? I need to plan this out. Okay, so, oh, we can have wheat right here, homes right here, or homes right here in the middle, and then everything works around it. That actually sounds like a good idea. So then, if that's the case, we kind of want our starting place to be right here then. Right? Is what I'm thinking. And then on top of that, we kind of make everything work around it. So let's do this right now. Get that building. Let's get a logging camp up here. Because right here... So I learned recently through a playthrough, I wanted to try to work on my starting uh, playthrough or like my startup. And I learned that you can actually just make a forest out of like anywhere. So what I'm going to try to do is actually... Cut down all this. Place it a little bit more back here, right? Wait, is there any fish rolling here? There's fish over there. There's no fish. Okay, no, not really any over here. So what we're going to do is this. We're going to place this right about here. I don't really know exactly where they're going to walk to, so I'm just going to do this. All right, build that. And pretty much get our startup going, which we're going to also do with this right about here. Yeah, like, eh. Honestly, I'm just gonna put it right here. Put it right next to it, why not? Uh, well, I'm forgetting something. Berries. Yes, berries. Of course. How could I forget? Put it right about here. Granary? I'm not sure where I want to put the granary, though. That's kind of a, something I'll do with on my own. I definitely want to put this right about... Hmm. Honestly, I don't know how the road's gonna be. So I'm just gonna kind of do this, really. E no, I kind of want it facing this way then. So it kind of just blocks itself off. Yeah, honestly, just do that. Make it right next to each other. So let's have these guys. Oh wait, I gotta can't forget. Extracting, extraction, and then reforestation. We should just do this, right? Yeah, reforestation. And then we want to extract all this. We want to get rid of all these trees, push it back. I want to separate it so there's no wild animals here. I kind of want to let them cut down all the trees first before we act. So it's gonna. So we're gonna let them build for a bit, and then we'll be right back. All right, everyone. So. We are back a little bit, so what's going on is we're kind of setting up our base stuff. So this is what I have planned. So cutting down all the trees in this area so it's kind of open. And maybe later we'll come back to it and reforest the area, depending on how I feel. But right now, this is how it is, or so far how it's going. A lot of the trees are already gone. A sawmill, warehouse, and then I also decided to put a bridge right over here. I thought about making two, one this way, but I feel like this is just going to be easier for now as the main route on and off the island, since it's going to be pretty much near the everything. And I'm going to save this place dedicated for wheat, maybe. Or I'm going to make cut all this down and make that place dedicated for wheat. Meanwhile, keeping all of this. This right here. Oh. Oh. Now, we do have access to own another territory for free. And guess which one? This one. So that one is going to be really what we're going to be working with. Is these two plots. Because I feel like it's going to be a better idea to just kind of hold back a bit. 
and not really claim as much land as I did before in my first playthrough because the taxes started really getting to me about um, pricing and especially with our man or what was it aspiration I want to get this one out of the way I just want to reach this one to say I did it because 100 citizens and never generate revenue from trade groups that I can say I did you know it's a hard one I really want this one Oh, I, I, ooh, I, I can't wait. I, I really want to do that one so badly. Because that's all that's on my mind right now is just that. Now, here's a problem we're going to be having right now. And that is we won't really have people until we complete the bridge. Which is one of the issues that I'm kind of facing right now. So, we're going to have to kind of deal with that. Uh, it's, I think, 75 planks in total. I think that is 75 planks in total. So this one's gonna hurt. It's gonna suck, and it's gonna be oof. Uh, oh, this one's building. Oh, now we need planks. Okay. So once this is out of the way, so we have all the stone we need, so we can actually start getting people out of here, so we can focus on wood cutting. Yes. Once they're done cutting all that. So let's get them all into here. I do want to create another lumber camp so our production can be a little better. It might not happen right now or at all right now. Can we do it in that? No, we can't. Our food is going to be pretty solid for... Oh, we only have one forger in mind. Let's cut back on one of the builders really quick. And then have one of these as a forester. Because wood is going to quickly disappear. And I want to be ready for when that happens by having another forest here once they're done cutting all those trees which they're doing pretty well on they're almost all gone we got like one two three four five six seven eight like nine more nine more trees and once that is done this oh i can't wait for this oh i this is going to be a really cool playthrough i'm actually really excited for this all right so this kind of I wish I was was recording during this moment, but there was a house here. I placed this bench right next to this house, and now this house is gone. Now, I don't know if this is a... I don't know if they're... No, they, no, they wouldn't. Um, uh, okay, I don't know if that's a common bug or anything. I'm not sure what happened here but um yeah that just kind of happened <laughs> what, what just <laughs> what oh yeah our bridge is finally made oh i'm so happy now now let's hope it actually works um so my problem is this my honestly could have made the bridge over here but or over here actually honestly yeah, honestly, over here would have been also fine. Thinking about it now, would have been a lot more less demanding. Now, I'm not sure where people are going to come from. I hope we get people at all. I'm kind of worried. Oh, nope. People are on their way, just on the farthest side of the world. Oh, that's not good. Alright, so... Not sure where that house went, to be honest. That kind of scares me. Now... This place is starting to open up a little bit more. I kind of want it to cut off a little bit. I don't really care about this right here. Oh, well, actually, they, they finished that. Pretty much. One house won't kill me. Now, eh, honestly, yeah, they did a pretty good job. I don't, I don't, yeah, honestly, we need to start focusing on faster wood production anyway. I can do this as a later project. We did pretty well. They pretty much did what I wanted them to do. So I'm just going to get rid of all that. And now our quick forest cutting adventure begins over here. Yeah. This looks satisfying, to be honest. Yeah. Wait, is it covering all of it? Yeah, it is. Perfect. So now we're going to have all that. You should maybe stop doing that now. And wood production i mean we have a lot of we have a lot of planks now so we could do what we need to do and just make some basic things so hmm, i'm trying to think of what i want to do here what do we have okay 
So, Hunter's Hut. Yes. <laughs> Honestly, yes. Uh, having two would be amazing. So, let's keep them both in here. Another over here. Where's it? Uh, Dutch food? Yeah, Hunter's Hut. Yep. Get two. Get one of these right about here. Here. Yeah. So, we don't have a granary. I totally forgot about that. <laughs> so, let's get this guy right about here. So, no. I kind of want it back over here, to be honest. Because it's more towards the woods. Like, something like over here would be good? Yeah, something like this. No. Nah. Yes, honestly, something like that would be nice. Because it's, then it's on the side. It's not really in the way. And then we need to build a granary. Because we forgot to do so. So that's great of me to forget that. Let's put it... I want to put it right here, but I want to have, like, the stonemason right there. So I kind of want to just slap it, like, right here. Because then it's, like, in the middle of everything. And then I can also move the meat over there if need be. Honestly, it's like a nice little cozy spot. We're going to have a stall right about here, actually. Yeah, let's have a stall right here. So then I have better access to food. And so we got one person. I kind of want to just slap them. Where do I want to put that one person? Our wood production is really good right now, so we don't have to worry about that. I think stone is one of our things we need to get back to. Oh, we got three people. There we go. One, three. Okay, so we got about four wood production and about one person in carpentry, which is fine. I do want to add another... Honestly, let's do that right now. No, I don't want to. Part of me wants to, but then I don't. So what I want to actually do is set up our... Yeah, here it is. This. This town hall. Where are we going to put it? I think we should put it over here. On, like, right here would be pretty nice, but I think right over here would make more sense, since it's going to be kind of in the main area. So let's think of how I want to do this. A nice little cliffside base would be pretty cool, to be honest. A cliffside town hall. So let's... Hmm, there's like so many things I want to do with this. I definitely want to bridge over that way. That honestly would cut our time in half for like people coming over. Yeah, let's put it like right about there. Uh, let's do this. Don't know what the point of that is, to be honest. Let's put it right down here, kind of farther away from that. But I always normally deck out this stuff now. Because I just feel like it's appropriate. You know, we're, we're going to build it. Might as well go all out. Except for, uh, tools are going to be a little difficult, actually. We can't generate revenue, so we got to be careful with our tools, to be honest. Functions for your momentum. I kind of want to just hold it off for now. I think that might just be the best idea. Just hold it off for now and just build what we got. Stone's going to be a little slow on that. Hopefully more people will show... Yep, right over there. More people are coming over. Do I want to build a bridge right now? Most likely not. <laughs> I was about to build a bridge. I just want the bare minimum down right now. So we got about six tools. So we're going to have about 11 left over. Okay, that works. I got to really think. I got to be really careful with all this. So that person I might just put into transportation. And then once we... I mean, it's only planks. I mean, it's not going to kill us, but it's going to take some time. Yeah, I kind of want to just do that. Just kind of make a bridge, you know? Like, something in me is just, like, create a bridge. Kind of make it angled. Oh. You know? Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. Let's get transportation up a little bit. So, that's going to be about 55 planks if I saw that correctly. Going to put this as priority so the resources actually just stick down to there. So, we're not focusing on this. 
I'm gonna buy this. Reminds me of New York. Alright, guys. So, we got a merchant here, I think. So, wood for the elders. We will gladly do that. Honestly? Oh, selling wood to the elders. Free money, pretty much. Uh, I'm not gonna complain about that. Uh, so give you guys an update. We are currently in the process of making more fishing huts so we can, you know, whenever we start trading, once we hit about 100 pomp, you know, we can start pomping off. Uh, this is a rustic church. I'm not going to really pay for tools right now since I don't really want to. And we are starting to actually start a construction of the bridge. Honestly, this is no revenue, so we actually could just buy from them. Now, okay, that is still there. We can buy from them, we just can't make revenue off them, so we can only buy. So let's, let's just pay for tools, you know? Um, we only have six, so let's pay for five at a time. How about that? I think that is a good request, since we need tools anyway, so we may as well buy them, and then we can always cut it off anytime. Now, I am a little worried about some stuff, but I think we got this. I want to stick with the clergy route, so once time comes, we can just trade like crazy. Oh. I also want to get- I also want to get this up as quick as possible, so I don't want to really extend myself too far. I want to take my time and slowly gain people. It says we're average. Happiness is low, 40%, I guess. I guess it's because of the food. So we need to find a way to fix that, which we will do right now. And we are going to try to make more diverse food choices right now, which is great. So let's do this right here. Build that. So then we have that. So we have berries to trade with people. So that actually goes up. And then on top of that, hopefully wins. Well, actually, wait a minute. We can just do that. And then we're, we'll, we'll eventually get meat going up. I want one of these to be done so then we could actually just get fish pretty easily. I didn't want to put it over here because it's right next to the people's homes. I might, eh, maybe, I might put another one right here or over here. I don't know. I don't know how they're going to work with the bridge. Oh, what is that? Oh, they're going to, wait, what do they want me to do? Uh-oh, well, this isn't perfect timing. Okay, well, let's find out what it is. Ow. Thanks for that. Thanks. Thank you. Alright, well, <laughs> our tool problem is now solved. I wish they did that before, but I guess not. So, okay, they're producing resources. We have about 13. Oh, that is taking forever. Let's add another one. And another one. Okay, good. Now we got meat cooking. Or meat. So we should be fine for a good bit. And there's only one person here, right? Yep, there's only one person there. So we definitely need more people to join our settlement so we can get some of these things popping off. How are we doing so far? I think we're doing pretty average. Yeah, because we're, we're almost that busy. So I think we're doing pretty well for now. Boy. Okay, so far we're doing good. I expanded the residential area. Our bailiff came back with news of an iron deposit. Now, I think that means these... So this was one green area, so this might be another, and this might be another. Let me double check here. Uh, yeah, so let's see. So this one, yeah, it's definitely right here. So it's checking right this one, and then it's going to be checking this one right here. So this is a nice group right here. I want to cut down all the trees so we don't have any problems. I want to put another village up here, actually, and make this a residential area. And then we can put, like, sheep farmers and another hunter's cottage up there so they can do all that. And then on top of that, they can go down here to work. So just in case, you know, it, they're closer by if need be. And hopefully, um, I also put a warehouse. And then I do plan on putting the blacksmith along with everything else right around this area. So it can be like a giant industrial port sort of thing. But that's once all this uh, trees are cut down. I might, I'm gonna get rid of this and put a forester up here. I do have another forest lumber camp going up there as well. I want to clear all this out. Yep, and then put a pot, and then really focus on a wood stuff over here, like a charcoal and a actual lumber thing. I just want to get everything out of the way first. Uh, as you can see with all the resources, we're doing phenomenal in everything, except for money. 
Now, our happiness is slowly going up. It's not really where I want it to be, though. We're holding off as long as possible. I Like I said, I wanted to get it over 70. But I don't think I'm going to get that. I think I'm going to get another... I'm going to have to bring it down to 30 again. Oh, never mind. Honestly, if I just wait for these people to show up and just don't do any other things... For example, I actually stopped our trading to uh, save us money. Tools were 56. So, honestly, 56 from now, we would have been about 62? No, 64. So, that would have gave us more breathing room to work with. But we don't. So, honestly, we're going to have to levy them again right now, maybe. Ooh, 129. Yes, that's honestly what we need. I want to get more tools. But with our money being a problem, we can't really do that. And I have to find ways to increase our income. So I'm trying to get more jobs so we have more people. We do have another housing problem. I actually might try to fix that right now. By kind of doing one move. So let's see. If that covers all that. What about if I did this? I'm trying to find a way to get them both. But I don't think that's possible. Now, there's no way. I'm going to have to only get this one. Wait. Let me double check. What's the cheaper option here? So this is 5. That's 20. Yes. Please do not destroy a house. Oh, thank you. Didn't destroy a house. Now I also want to increase someone's... Whose house is this? Who lives here? In Mildut. Mildut. If we increase her by one, I think that also goes up, so that would fix our house problem. Mildut. Mildut. Where is she? Where is she? We have four people unemployed, so that's good. Where is she? I hope this is her. If not, we're not going to have a good time. Alright, everyone. So, we're going to try to make a move here. I'm going to increase our supply with food, increasing our jobs. Uh, I got this going over here. They're actually making good progress to clearing all this out up there and there. This is going to be filled, hopefully. Maybe. I don't think it is. Oh, well. But, oh, we need people. So, our money went up. I did take the risk. I did buy this so we can get this. I also want also started our trading of tools hopefully that also gets up which is going to be a risk for our money supply we hit 60 percent i used the levy again we're now back at down in the 30s again so hopefully me doing this can actually change something especially in our money supply and our cost so far we hit about 60 coins and 60 percent happiness so i'm going to try to keep pushing we're so close, almost halfway there. Oh boy. So we have about 47 population. I want to buy another territory and then start that, but I want to actually clear this place out up here. So then we can get more people. Hopefully. Money-wise, I don't think we're doing too hot. I'm really worried right now. Because I think this is why it's hard, is because you hit this kind of point. Now, I'm trying to think of what to do here. We have to buy tools still, which I'm just still worried about. And we have about 144 and decreasing. So, last month, this month, 78. We could try to hope that... We could try to promote villagers. Maybe. I'm, I'm still really worried about it. How is it doing? See, I want to increase our goods. Our goods output. Food-wise, everything up here is amazing. We're just overstocked on everything. Like, right over here, won't get more. Wait, actually, wait a minute. Could I just do that? Wait, would that actually work? Oh. Is that... Wait. Would this actually work? I'm, I'm just thinking right now. Would that? I think it actually might. We'll find out. If, if that actually works... That's going to be interesting. Alright, everyone. So, <laughs> I feel like I'm just opening up with that every time. I actually under I actually started understanding the tax guy. Let me double check this. Mandates. That's not it. Where was it? It was uh right here. So, I actually somewhat found the taxes tab here once I started got getting it open. 
and it seems like we're hopefully going to get taxes. So this is how much we're supposed to be making a month. 148 with one... Wait, you're two. I have no idea. So it's... I, I don't know how the taxes work. But so anyway, it's supposed to be minus 13% from about 71. So hopefully we're going to get it. I'm not sure. Uh, I'm definitely going to have to do another mandate so we don't go in the negatives. But it seems like we are. However, if this goes through, then we won't really have an issue with money anymore. And then if we do the mandate on top of that, we're going to get literally double this amount. I think I was going to get about a hundred and... Let me double check. hundred and... Oh, two hundred and... Yeah, two hundred and twenty plus pretty much. So, that's good. We just need to do all that. Hopefully it comes out on time. Oh, we get we're getting money now. We're getting money. Um uh, I don't think it's gonna be enough though. We might actually have to do that mandate. Okay, we're not getting enough money right now. I think it just collects later. Oh <gasps> nope, the money came in. Oh <laughs> the money now comes in. So I could also Tax is minus 9, so about 16% on that. So it's going to be plus 3. So it's going to be about 71 is the average. So that should be good. Yeah, I hope so. I'm not... It's going to go back and forth. I might actually have to do that mandate. Yeah, I'm going to have to do that mandate. Just keep us afloat. And then it's going to be about 60... Yeah, we're going to have to. Unless it goes back up. I don't know, I kind of want to just hold off and see. Oh, like, I really want to. Oh, oh wait, we get 50 from windmills? Oh, okay. Residential, so it they collect it and then they come to us and pay it. So that's how much they're generating. Huh. So we just need to collect it then. Yeah, okay, so it's kind of just teetering right here, which is good. If it goes down to 15, so that would be about 79, 79%. Honestly, if it, I might just hold off till that and then do the mandate to be safe, is what I'm thinking. Oh my god, this is the last one we need for the dedicated labor. Wait. This, this should be done. Wait, why is it not done? Wait. Okay, hold up. Never generate revenue from trade routes. We never did that. What's what's going on here? Do we need to have more than a hundred, or like, does it mean this? Like, what does it mean by a hundred? Like, but what, what? We have we have a hundred. We we have a hundred. What do you mean? It, is it just like a little? You're kidding. Ah. Uh, uh, what do you, what do you mean? Um, oh wow, okay, that one's, well, we weren't going to get that one. Optional objectives. List of quests. Okay, but we, we did that one, right? Do we get something, or does no nothing happen? Uh, okay, another person's coming, so we're gonna see what happens. All right, here's the person, and okay, so I'm guessing it's not counting this. All right, so I guess it wants it to be in one tile, so it's not counting this, I guess. Which I. Oh, okay. I'm gonna say we actually did beat that because that was kind of crazy. We we definitely did. Um, hundred seven hundred. Oh my god. We we definitely did beat this. Um, I don't care what it says. We we definitely did do it. I don't know why it's not triggering, but we definitely did do it. A uh, hundred and one people, and we did not trade, or else it would have, you know, gone off. So. Uh, I'm gonna end the video here because like this was so long for me waiting for this so this entire time 
I've been waiting for this just to do this and it doesn't work. <sighs> I'm going to bed. I'm upset, but I'm also kind of happy with how the village turned out. I actually really like this one too. So with that being said, thank you guys for watching and whew, go outside.